Hey guys, Filthy Robot here, continuing our Imperial Ideals campaign with the Roomba, where he uh, repeatedly tries to sabotage my ability to advance in this game for no apparent reason. I, I love that. I love that. That's what you think I do. That's, <laughs> that's the truth hurts. It's, it's pretty special, right there. Is there a way to make multiple uh, regiments move across without splitting? Multiple regiments move across without splitting. How do you in, mean? In your builder, like, can I, can I? There's no way I can like shift click and like select like 10 regiments all at once, right? Uh, the top where it says like infantry, cavalry and stuff, right clicking yeah. will send half. Yeah. Okay. So right click that on the helpful. infantry and then right click on the other side, you can send half of what you sent over back if you want to get a quarter. Or if you want to use keyboard shortcuts, you can just use the B key to send the bottom listed unit. And if you have enough infantry in a singular army, it'll almost always be infantry at the bottom of the list. So you just move over one infantry at a time. Okay. You ready to go? Yep. Go ahead. Portugal's about to suicide some more men at me. Again, with no leader. I, I think Portugal... Um, remember a while back we talked about how the AI gets a certain amount of like heads to their, their program mm -hmm. and their intelligence? I think that they determined that Portugal's too weak and he doesn't deserve one. Because he's just... He's not even trying here to, to do anything intelligent. It's quite quite nice. That's surprising losing this fight. That's kind of annoying. Alright, guess I'm retreating. He's at like half morale. I wasn't expecting him to do very well. He did fine. Do you have a tech advantage over him? Ooh. Milan's on tech 18. Yeah, might have been it. Let's get some gallop cavalry. How are we doing on uh, technologies or institutions and stuff? What? Apparently I haven't embraced the global trade institution yet. Sixteen percent penalty. Oh, that's right. I was trying to make it so that I was the one that spawned this thing, and then it didn't spawn. I was very mad. If I remember correctly. Got my best leader doing something stupid right now. All right, I need a second to mess with this because I'm currently doing really dumb things, and it would be nice if I wasn't really doing dumb things, you know. Can you give me two days so that I can do it too? Uh, yes, I can. Okay, stop. Ah, you're supposed to stop in two days. Why don't you stop in two days? Uh, aren't you able to pause and unpause yourself, being the host? Well, well yeah, but I assumed that you would take care of it. I see, I see. To me, it seemed like a fairly reasonable thing to assume. <laughs> okay. Uh... Yeah, I'm good to go now. If you are, yeah, just for I mean, I'm gonna need some more pauses. Play yeah, this ahead. in a couple of days, and yeah, okay. go ahead and unpause whenever or pause when you need to. It's fine. Right. I'm expecting to train some uh, change some leaders around right now. Yeah, you're using the N key, right? The N key, no. While holding an army, while having an army or navy selected, the N key will bring up the appoint leader interface. The N key, while on the appoint leader interface, will unassign the current leader. So you can grab an army, press mm. N twice to unassign. Grab a different army, press N to open the interface, and basically instantaneously teleport your generals around. Hmm. Very useful. That's very useful. Okay, right, I'm ready to unpause viewer. Yeah, go ahead. I'm spending 17 ducats a month right now on forts. That's a lot. Let's make Burgundy pay for it. I don't want to pay for that. It's too much. Can you revoke military access from me for a second? Yes. Thanks. Oh, he's in your borders, isn't he? That's you're the great. emperor. So it doesn't make any difference. Ah, you're the emperor, okay, you're at war. I, I did just do it, but uh, it doesn't make any difference. He'll have access to every province that's inside the empire. Which you makes know, some know, really squirrely things happen with the zone of control. Okay, so I'm, I'm literally just waiting on the siege of a level one fort over here. Unnecessarily, unnecessary attrition right now. It's great.
For some reason, we ever wanted to be the Emperor. Can't, can't recall why. That sounded like a good idea at one point. Oh, I saw oh. a piece deal from the Ottomans. It's probably separate piece, but it might be the, the full piece. Check to see if he's still at war. No, he's still at war. All of my intentions in the uh, in South America right now, just so you know. If you are expecting me to be paying attention to the Ottomans or anything else that's going on right now, I am not there. Okay. Thanks, game, for putting that interface right in front of me. Appreciate it. Yeah, right in the middle when you're doing wars. That always happens for me. It's obnoxious as shit. Ludwig just came into power. Nice. Mm. My consort. My consort was actually better. Oh, I have a new. I have <laughs> a new mission available. Become emperor. Sounds like yes. a good one. Take that mission. I'll no. I can assist you'll, you in that mission. You'll help me. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Uh, let me pause for a second. Let's see. Ooh, my gosh. Holy crap. Talk about stacking modifiers. Uh, my character's ruler trait is kind-hearted. Monthly war exhaustion minus 0.05. Mm -hmm. So, <laughs> while at war, I lose uh, 0.1. While at peace, I lose 0.2. It's pretty crazy. Yeah, it's pretty okay, good. I am, uh, I'm ready to peace out Mr. Portugal Man. And I have probably one of the most stupendous peace deals I've done in this entire campaign. What's that? Do you want me to... Do you just want to see the pop-up, or should I just tell you some yeah, of the, the primary pop -up. Cliff, no, cliff no, notes? No, no, no. no. I, well, sure, cliff notes. Okay, so it's just 11 prestige, which we've done much more than that before. It's going to cost me 673 diplo points. 190, 190 uh, aggressive expansion base. However, it's mostly centralized in the New World, so nobody really cares. It's just uh, Castile, Brandenburg, Brittany. 60% overextension. It's going to cost 1,200 admin points to core, but not really. The only thing I need is I need to preferably be at war with Brandenburg already so that they can't join this coalition. Okay. Well, go ahead and pause. Alright. I guess I might have to wait a couple more months then until the Ottomans is done with their war. They are at uh, 99 war score, so they should be wrapping it up pretty soon. All right, taking a less than ideal fight. That's okay. What are you talking about? 40 on 25 and flat terrain? Yeah, but I don't have the cannons. The 3-4 liter? Ah, uh, yeah, the cannons. The cannons. Nice. 10 versus a 9. Stack wipe? No. Where's he going? Looks like he's going just one province over. You should get a stack wipe, maybe? Ah, shoot. He's going west. I want you to win your war. You need to be done. Yeah, I'd like to be done, too. Yeah, you know, I'm simultaneously sieging his cap as this happens, so... I'm a little what bit concerned. What is this path he's taking? Holy crap. There's some annoying rebels I'm gonna have to take care of in the New World, so... If we get in this war soon... That would be preferable. And by end this war, I mean declare a new war. Pop-ups and war. Super annoying. <laughs> I still have plus one opinion with Brandenburg because I came to the defense of the Empire. That's kind of funny. Alright. I'm pausing again if you're ready. Mm-hmm. Let's see. What's our cavalry flanking range these days? Do we actually have the tech for six cav? If we wanted to? No. Not until Miltech 18. That's next level. Nice. That's soon. I forgot that it goes up. That kind of flanking range it does go up there, doesn't yeah. it? Late, late game, even infantry can flank two tiles. Hmm. Okay, I'm going to improve relations with Mr. Brandenburg. Also, I'm a great power, um, so they say. Yeah, so this should, seems sketchy. I should use some of those interactions. Influence Maybe they nation. overestimated your abilities? Steel has a lot of debt. Right, let me just take a quick look if I can get what I want out of this. Milan is still at medium enthusiasm, despite the fact they have their fucking capital occupied. 
It's hilarious. All right, let me just see though. I might still be able to get it. I want. I think it matters. If I separate piece mill. I guess I want a separate piece mill one for money though. All right. Well, you should consider separate piecing him just for the fact that he'll uh, he'll have a different cooldown timer. Man, Portuguese, <laughs> Portuguese Brazil is just, they don't want to give up. They're fighting three times as hard as Portugal ever did. Yeah. They're actually training troops and stuff. It's kind of kind of cute. Uh, I need just like a couple of sequences of pauses here. Commonwealth has 17 reasons for peace, or reasons to accept. I don't know why the Ottomans are not ending their war. They've got them 100% occupied. Unless there's someone else. No, it's just Armenia. He's got a 99 war score. Al Karak, occupied by Armenia. Al Karak? What? Oh, there's just this random fort in the middle of what used to be the Mamluks that somehow got occupied by Iraq. Ready for an unpause? Yep, go ahead. Are you going to win your war now? Maybe. I'm, just, I'm fighting 60 on 20k, and I have 20 cannons behind them, and full with stack with flanking and he doesn't so I expect I'm gonna be I'm gonna be decreasing his enthusiasm I assume from this I would hope so just my just my thought stupid English I kick their butt someday it's gonna be glorious okay um, I'm gonna pause real quick because I wanted to, I might want to take this piece deal right before the annual tick for the aggressive expansion decay Okay, I could use a pause here anyways. I could split off some cannons. Okay, so... Castile's not going to be too happy about this. I might lose my alliance with Castile based on this. I'm okay with that. Really, it's just Brittany, Castile, and Brandenburg. And Alsace and Liege, but they don't matter. Yeah, I'm just going to do this. This, is, this seems like the right thing to do. Okay. Okay, here's this ridiculous piece deal. And... Boom. It's, it's a lot of stuff in there. Yep. Okay, now I definitely need some time because I've got to actually decide like what to do with all this. Milan well, is surprisingly enthusiastic about this deal. Okay, so this is a colony. This is a colony. Colonial regions. That is part of colonial Brazil. Of course, the unrest is going to be huge, but we'll just keep some troops here for a while. Hmm. Why did that not work? What are you filling out over there? Do you need help? Do you need assistance? Hmm. No, it's just it shows like I can actually core stuff that I can't, and then it pretends like it actually did it, but it didn't. Okay, so we got 24, 40, 44, 76, 120. Pick that one. Okay, um... Are you getting this institute anytime soon? I'm not sure. It's uh, I think it's just money. I think I've got enough stuff. Yeah. Let me check. I do. I need 1,100 ducats, and I could embrace it, but I just spent like 500, so... Yeah. It'll take me a little while. It would be nice to have. I haven't been doing very much tech lately. I took, a, took an admin tech. So just, okay. I wanted that um, discount. Ottomans at 99. Okay. So that looks like probably the last thing we're going to worry about before warring Muscovy or Commonwealth then, right? It's the Ottomans timer. Not timer, but his, uh, his war. Can you move it forward three days? Uh, if you give me like 20 seconds, I'm already done. So. Okay. 32, 12, and 12. 
Okay, I think I'm good to go. I'm going to be paying a lot of attention to the new world to put down rebels and stuff for a while, but um, okay. it's looking pretty pretty good. Okay. okay. And let's unpause then and see how big the coalition gets. Also, I need to core Lisboa. All right, that should crush their enthusiasm a little bit. There's no real coalition against me yet. So that's Your a good game sign. is no longer in sync. Error code and ends underscore 35, 37, 58, 59. Fantastic. Well, we're a few minutes early, but this does happen so seldom that I don't really worry too much about making one episode a little bit shorter. Do you? No, I think that's fine. Let's go ahead and cut the part here, and we'll uh, see you guys soon. All right. Thanks for watching, everyone. We'll be back in a bit.